you are going to get soul lifting messages, faith based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. Now unto the Lamb upon the throne, we raise a sound, we raise a sound. For He is God and God alone. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Can I tell you this? HIV is a wicked and demonic whatever. And let me tell you, don't you think everyone who gets HIV got it from maybe living a wayward life? I have prayed for whole families where someone came in the dream, true story, with a syringe and injected them physic in the dream and they woke up physically with HIV. So not everybody you see with HIV, don't stigmatize anyone. You see that now because there are people who have this thing for various reasons. But this is why God puts a miracle service. Imagine the shame and reproach three times. Three times. Father, ma Madam, don't cry, huh? In the name of Jesus Christ, everything you have lost as a result of this reproach, not only has God healed you, but we declare a restoration. Opportunities and all kinds of relationships you have lost. Let there be restoration right now. In Jesus' name. Yes, please. She has had severe heart issues. In fact, her, her brother is a medical doctor. Because of how serious the case was. Heart issue. Heart issues. She, weakness all around her body. She couldn't climb stairs. But the power of God came upon her. And she can raise up her hand very well. Give all her the this mic. she could not do before. Give when her the I mic. came during the prayer, I couldn't even raise this paper up. Like, I had to be bringing my Raise it up. Out. Let the devil see it. Come, my dear, run. Come and climb up. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Heart condition. Couldn't even raise that thing up. You see how bad the devil is. If you cannot raise your hand up, the same way he brings down people's hands, he can bring down people's finances. He can bring down people's honor. Everything that has been brought down that you could not raise up. Kaparus katebalakata. In the name of Jesus, here at this miracle service, if God could raise a hand back, may He raise your finances back. May He raise your honor back. May he raise your wisdom back. May he raise your fire back. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, please. Quickly. You mentioned cases of skin rashes, hitches. The part of he has had it since 2009. What is that? Skin hitches, rashes on the skin. Rashes? Yes. Okay. The, no, no, no. Please, we don't have time for the text. Just straight the to the The power of God what? came upon him and yes. sound now. Completely. Completely. The same thing with her. The same thing with you yes how long what happened to you i don't know the, the, the screen rashes just came since six months now i've been taking medications nothing and, and you, now you just mentioned i'm not feeling any you're any not feeling stuff. the itch yes. again in the name of jesus it will never return to you in jesus name yes sir so apostle just quickly praise god um some three weeks ago i had a miscarriage and i lost so much blood and as a result of that i've been having a numbing on my oh dear let's leg so coming into this place tonight, I felt the power of God. And you mentioned my case. You said somebody came with a left knee um, problem. So three weeks ago. Three weeks ago. So mm. immediately I felt perfectly okay. I can do everything. Do you have now. children? No. How long have you been married? Last year. Do you believe in miracles? Yes, sir. Place your hand on your stomach. Father, in the name of Jesus, look at me. You believe in Jesus? I stretch my hands right now. In the name that is above all names 
I command that devil I'm seeing, let her go. Right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Out of her now. It's not miscarriage anything. These are demons from the pit of hell. Be delivered right now. Let me pray for everyone here. Trusting God for the fruit of the womb. In the name of Jesus, whether for you or your loved ones, I decree and declare by the power that raised Christ from the dead, return with miracle children. Return with miracle children. Return with miracle children. My dear, tell her to write it. God will give her a baby boy. If her husband is here, write it. God bless you. In the name of Jesus. Remember not the former things, nor consider the things of old, for the Lord is doing a new thing for you. Yes, sir. So a person he has a very strange condition. When he sits under the AC, no matter how low it is, he begins to find difficulty breathing and it actually affects him so he has a very severe headache just from that experience. once you sit under yes. ac once sits under the ac so headache or kata man of god i greet you in jesus name amen and my name is emmanuel um, yes just just the so, condition yes. sorry because so, of time so just for time yes. sake apostle so the moment you prayed for healing for people with migraines and all just a miracle for him instantly. for nine years it's nine years for nine years you can't, can't sit under ac I cannot sit under ac and anytime i go out with my governor to work with him i do cover my nose and uh, immediately i i come in today for the miracle service and i discover that i am supposed to remove my face mask. in the name of jesus christ Amen. i pray for you it is permanent it never returns to you again in jesus name please let's have two here and then maybe my god there are so many testimonies do you know what let me tell you this if you are unable to testify today don't close down your testimony we need to hear what jesus is doing the medical team you can get it we can collate it and then by next week we can invite you to come and let the house know what jesus is doing it's not a good thing to be silent over profitable testimonies they help strengthen the body more than just showing that the man of god is powerful the testimony of Jesus is the spirit of prophecy. Just one, two, or three striking ones, and then we'll have... Yes, sir. So, sir, these are sportsmen, and it will be interesting to actually hear what they have to say about their conditions. So yes, sir. Straight to the point. Yes, I have serious problem with my left leg. I'm in Abuja presently because a physiotherapist is taking care of the leg for like a month, my left leg. I what do you do? I play football. Oh, you're a footballer? Yes. I, I was playing for Kano Pillars before I had the injury, and then I left for two years. So... I can't really work well. I can't really play well. I've been struggling with it. I've done all X-ray, yes. the scan, and the rest. And then during the anointing, when he mentioned the left leg, somebody cannot really do stuff. And there, there's yes. always pains there. So I didn't want to... I had to go to the bedroom and check. And then when I came back, my friend is sitting there. I said, Maduka, my leg, I can't feel the pain again. He said, Check it now. Me. Check it. Completely. You were playing for Kano Pillars before. Yes, sir. Can I pray? You really want to play football professionally? Yes, Let me pray for you. Look at me. My friend, believe in the power of God. You will be surprised. There is a grace that can shift people. I stretch my hands. What's your name? Shama. Shama. Tanzi. Don't rise and run away from God, though, because let me just give you a disclaimer. Most people they use God when they get there they just dump him and enjoy God is raising people who love him but I stand by the God of heaven see there is a king maker anointing king makers never become kings themselves but they can enthrone kings and dethrone kings I stretch my hands now and I pray for you my friend carry this grace go to the field I pray that God will use you marvelously you will be a source of pride to your family let this be the beginning of great days in your life in Jesus' name I pray. Amen and amen. God bless you. So, Apostle, oh. a similar condition, but he popped his knee playing basketball. You're a basketball. footballer too? No, I was playing basketball a few, mix, a few months back. So, I popped my left knee. Okay. I couldn't walk out with a limp. And now? And now, as soon as you check yourself. Say, I can jump. Check yourself. <laughs> check yourself. <laughs> In the name of Jesus Christ, this healing remains permanent and the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name. Let's have a last one from this our little one. So, Apostle, this is interesting. He couldn't fold his legs, like bend his legs, but now... How old, how old are you, my friend? Eleven. Eleven? You couldn't fold your leg? 
What happened? He was playing ball. He you were born playing, that way. Playing, no, he okay, was playing ball. Okay, go ahead. Fold it now. Any pain? Any pain? Completely gone. Supernatural miracle. May God raise you to become a mighty vessel in his hands. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Yes, please, Apostle, very quickly. Three years partial deafness in the left ear. Gone. She couldn't hear properly with it. Your but left now, ear? Yes, How long? Over three years now. Can you imagine this? Yes, but now I can hear perfectly. Very clearly. Yes, very clearly, sir. May you hear the voice of your destiny helper. Yes. That ear that has opened, whether spiritually I use, because there is physical deafness, there is financial deafness, there is destiny deafness. I'm praying for you the same way God opened her ears in the name of Jesus Christ. In every realm of life where your ears cannot hear, let it be open right now in Jesus' name. You will not hear the voice of your enemy. As that ear is open, you will hear the voice of your helpers. In Jesus' name I pray. Yes, please. Partial blindness. Her right eye. She couldn't see with it properly. So the doctor confirmed it. They asked her to close the left eye and then ask her to see. And How she long? Can see. Madam? Three months and now, sir. And you, you could not see with which, which of them? The right eyes. Close the one you could not see with. Close the one you could see with. No, she's closing two of them. Close. How, how do I tell her now? Yes. Madam, Sir. walk. Walk to the camera. Walk to the camera. Just follow the camera. Follow the camera. Look at what God is doing. Ah, look at this. To break every chain, break every chain break every chain that's all right in the name of jesus christ madam look at me i decree and declare you can you can clearly see when you see her eyes you can see that this it's almost as if she's completely blind in jesus name we correct this situation now in jesus name please let that be the last for now so that we can you mentioned pelvic gadu pain are you together with the boy Okay, so let's, let's just do it with the boy once and for all. And that will be it. Yes, please. The pelvic gadu pain has gone down. Okay, what says, happened to you, Mama? I had a pelvic gadu pain. And for a very long time, but very, very lately, it's been very painful. So during the praise worship, I danced as if I, I've, I never danced before. So uh, yes. after I felt the pain was gone. Completely. Completely, but when pressing it you will I still feel still a bit feel of pain, pain yes but when the word of knowledge came the pain was gone completely Complete. check it now any pain any pain secondly there was something like a phlegm like cough on my throat okay i tried so many times to cough it out but it let, let him testify with the boy after yes but just now it's gone. it's gone. It will never return to you again, Mama. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Yes, please. Very quickly. If, if you're yet to confirm it, that's all right. We'll pray. You mentioned the case of bipolar. So he just came to present. Oh, the, uh, the in the case. name of Jesus Christ, I stretch my hands over the little boy. How old is he? Nine years. Who is? Nine. Years. Nine. Nine. Yes. How old? Nine years. In the name of Jesus Christ, I stretch my hands over the little one. Amen. Bipolar. Amen. Be completely healed right now. Amen. Okay, two of them. In Jesus' name, I lay my hands on both of them. Oh, you can see this one is not bipolar. Now, this looks like autism. In the name of Jesus, let there be healing for both of them. You know, sometimes these conditions can be so challenging. You can't imagine how it is. In Jesus' name, let there be a miracle for them. And I, I pray for all of you. We apologize that we didn't have the time. But I pray that your miracles remain permanent. In Jesus' name. And for all those who have received their miracles at home, I decree and declare supernatural healing for you. In Jesus' name. And it remains permanent. Can you stretch your hands here for a moment? We're about rounding up. If you can stand, please. This is the final 
the stage apologies is a miracle service and sometimes it will stretch us a bit just stretch your hands in one minute as we decree and declare i believe in the power of the holy spirit this for me is one of the major part of this meeting because this is the most accurate representation of people's desires we see in part we prophesy in part doesn't matter who is healed sometimes you just cannot minister enough but i want you to stretch your hands right now and begin to declare over these requests we decree and we declare online offline we declare by the spirit of the living god father we decree and declare let there be miracles turn everyone's mourning to dancing sorrow to joy in the name of jesus christ every garment of shame for the spirit of heaviness that they might be called the oaks of righteousness the planting of the lord that he might be glorified i decree and declare right now over every request here i pray by the power that raised christ from the dead that every request here is turned for a testimony in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ i'm praying if there is any death sentence here represented in the name of jesus we avert it right now yeah. embarrassing financial conditions we turn that shame and that reproach to honor in jesus name yeah. i decree and declare that every victory that satan may seem to be having over every life we decree the same way jesus rose up from the dead in the name of jesus everything that looks dead it must come back to life and as i would always declare i decree upon these requests that these egyptians you see today in the name of jesus christ who is the son of the living god may you see them no more forever in the name of jesus christ now let me speak over your life i truly believe in the power of prophecy every financial door i just sense in my heart to pray if you don't believe it don't worry wait for what you believe that i'm talking about then you receive but i pray right now every financial door that has been closed over everyone here in the name of jesus causing all kinds of constraints and inconveniences in the name of jesus let that door be open now financial doors be open now financial doors be open now for individuals for institutions for families financial doors be open now so that you will have supplies that will give you the opportunity to focus on your work with god and your destiny again i pray that those doors be open now hear me anyone here who is in any kind of debt personal debt corporate debt in the name of jesus the son of the living god by the power that raised christ up from the dead come out of that situation now everyone who has promised to help you and has forgotten about you in the name of jesus right now here at this miracle service i decree and declare let the book of remembrance be open concerning you let the book of remembrance be open concerning you hallelujah there is a garment of favor that an individual can wear and you can wear and move and everything around you will attest to the fact that you carry that garment every garment of shame and reproach prophetically i remove it from you right now and i decree and declare for your shame may god grant you access to the garment of favor favor in the city favor in the country favor in the morning favor in the afternoon favor in the night in the name of jesus christ
hallelujah please help them i want to pray if there is any addiction that the devil is using to trap you because many people's finances go because of all kinds of addiction i decree and declare right now any addiction that is trapping your life trapping your destiny here at this miracle service the power of that addiction over your life let it be broken now 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 We believe in winning families. Any family here that is under siege, troubles every day, joblessness, weakness, death, in the name that is above all names, I speak over every family here represented. Step into a new season of favor. I pray for your spiritual life because you see no matter what else works in your life if your prayer life your word life your passion for God and for the things of God if it goes down everything went down therefore I decree in the name of Jesus for someone's prayer life here that is yet to catch fire I release my faith with you from tonight spiritual laziness that will not allow you pray that will not allow you fast that will not allow you study scripture in the name of jesus we declare the spirit that is behind it let it live your life now i declare fresh fire over your spirit man fire for prayer fire for word study fire for fellowship in the name of jesus christ Finally, I pray for you. We are stepping into October. I want to speak over your life. Everything you saw at the beginning of this year that your hands has not yet handled between the remaining days, now and the end of September, I decree and declare you will enter October with that expectation in your hand. You will enter October with that expectation in your hand. In the name of Jesus Christ. Wave your hands to Jesus and give him praise tonight. Father, we honor you and we bless you. Now, please look up. Next month is um, next month has so many things. Um, we're going to have the practicum of our students, like you saw. Uh, Koinonia School of Ministry students, amazing people, both here and Zaria. And then their graduation will also happen next month. And then we have, uh, oh, I think almost every, every week of next month is really going to be a miracle service because there is going to be such a mighty visitation and an outpouring. Now, here's what I want you to do. You have benefited here. Please do well particularly your family members you can invite any other person but please your family members let them come and encounter the god of heaven so that god can grant you rest in the name of jesus christ hallelujah we appreciate our zaria family and our family online and for those of you dearly beloved i hope you were blessed by this message do not keep the video to yourself share to as many as you can to help them bless. Check our homepage for more of our messages. Subscribe to the channel, comment on it, like it. See you on our next video. Bye. Pray, pray, pray for your destiny. the face of development lord grant me the discipline